Hi, my name is Irene Kiongisha, a postgraduate student at the University of Cape Town in South Africa. My talk is about a data harmonization platform that we developed for systematic integration of large-scale clinical datasets. A brief overview of some of the clinical research data challenges and opportunities. Several studies have shown that using large sample sizes significantly boosts predictive power and increases the confidence level of study outputs, thereby minimizing potential false positive rates. However, large-scale genomic clinical and phenotype data are often generated in silos at different research sites. Genomic datasets are generally easier to harmonize due to existing genomic data standards. This is not the case with clinical and phenotype datasets that are challenging to systematically harmonize due to high levels of heterogeneity. In order to address these challenges, we suggest an automated variable mapping process to help minimize manual interference and errors. We developed a model that utilizes ontological search matching coupled with natural language based word graph similarity information retrieval for automatic data harmonization and integration. The model has two main systematic processes, that is, the human to machine and machine to human. In the human to machine process, data elements mapping is done automatically without requiring manual interference, while in the machine to human process, manual curation is required mainly in cases where more than one matching variable is identified, thereby necessitating domain expert judgment. In the human to machine process, different research sites codebooks are merged and data elements retrieved can be exactly mapped or matched using ontologies or unmatched. The ontology mapped data elements are retrieved and added to the standardized data element set. The standardized data element set is a non-redundant set of data elements that provides a reconciled view of different sites data elements or codebooks. Unmatched data elements are processed using NLP-based word graph similarity information retrieval where similarity scores are computed and a given word or word sequence is mapped to words or word sequences with high semantic similarity scores. This process is used to identify similarity-based data elements that can be mapped and the final set of unmapped elements that couldn't be reconciled. These are then added to the standardized data element set. In the machine to human process, the standardized codebook integrating different sites data elements and the data dictionary mapping matched variables between sites are optimized through manual curation. This mainly focuses on cases where more than one matching variable is identified and thereby requiring domain expert judgment. Then the final set of harmonized multi-site integrated data elements is produced. This is a summary of the automated data harmonization workflow, where it starts from combining data elements to retrieving data elements using ontologies and dealing with unmapped elements using, using NLP and then computing similarity scores and then building the standardized data elements. The model was tested on harmonizing multi-site data dictionaries 
from the SICO in Africa Consortium. The SICO in Africa registry comprises of data from over 13,000 sickle cell disease patients in Sub-Saharan Africa. Ontology mapping was done using the sickle cell disease ontology and other ontologies were used in the further testing of the model, that is the human phenotype ontology, the disease ontology, and monarch merged disease ontology, among others. Model performance scores were calculated for different mapped data elements and a set of manually selected best matches between sites were constructed by the SICO in Africa database working group. Using the manually selected best matches set, the prioritization of matches was evaluated using non-performance metrics such as area under the curve of receiver operating characteristics, accuracy, precision, sensitivity, and specificity scores. This figure shows the results of the model performance in matching elements between sites. Overall, the model showed very good performance. These are some of the results of the model performance on harmonizing the SICO in Africa data. This was data from three SICO in Africa sites, that is Ghana, Nigeria, and Tanzania. Figure A shows model suggested shared based matches between sites and text graph based similarity search with a similarity threshold set at 0.7 had the best performance. Figure B shows the total number of harmonized data elements between the three research sites. The data harmonization model suggested is flexible, adaptable, and generalizable. It constitutes a tool for biomedical data exchange and interoperability. Therefore, External third-party applications may integrate it into their workflow. This model is open source and can be found at the SICO in Africa GitHub repository. This work was done in collaboration with the SICO in Africa database working group, which constitutes members from the three SICO in Africa research sites and the SICO Africa Data Coordinating Center, as well as the SICO Cell Disease Ontology Working Group, with support from the NIH National Heart, Lung and Blood Institute. Thank you.